Welcome! In front of me I have Xiaomi Watch 2 Pro and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the Android phone. First we need to turn on our watch and you can do it by pressing and holding the lower button right here. Keep holding the button until you see the Xiaomi logo on the screen. Once you see the logo you can release the button and wait until the watch is done booting up. And once the watch boots up, you should see the let's go message on the screen. You can tap on the arrow to continue. It will open the uh, list of languages. And what you can do is to scroll through the list of languages, look for something you like, for the language you like. And once you find the language you, you like, you can tap on it to select it and apply it. And now we need to download and install the Mi Fitness application on the phone we want to pair our watch with. So go to your phone, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do open the Play Store, tap on search, uh, tap on the search bar and type in uh, Mi Fitness and then tap on search. And you should see this application on the list, Mi Fitness by, or formerly known as Xiaomi Wear. Tap on in the install button to install it. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on open to open it. In the app, tap on start, uh, agree. Uh, right, we need to check the first box, I believe, and then we can tap on Agree. Next, we need to select a region, service region. You can tap here, scroll through the list, look for something you like, tap on it to select it. And once you select the service region, tap on Next. And you should see the health page of the app. Now tap on Device icon, tap on Add Device, and it will uh, ask you to allow and enable the Bluetooth. If you see it, tap on Agree and Agree, and then Allow and it should start searching for nearby devices and it should detect your Xiaomi Watch 2 Pro. Tap on it to select it. Tap on Pair. Tap on Agree. Tap on More, Agree. Allow the permission. Here you can tap on Next. And right here we can copy a Google account to our watch. This is useful if we want to use a Google features on our watch like Play Store, Maps and stuff like that. If you don't care, you can tap on Skip and not copy the account to your watch. But if you want to use any of the features, um, Google features, you will need to copy the account. And basically, if you don't have an account, because as you can see, I already have an account right here on my phone, so I can copy it to uh, to my to my watch, but if you don't have any account, you can basically log in into a Google account and then copy it. I'm gonna tap on continue. Uh, probably will need to enter to the password to confirm that it's my account. Yep. So give me a couple of seconds. I'm gonna enter the password. Okay. Tap next. And after you, you enter the password, it will start copying the account to your uh, watch. You can also copy the account, or rather log in into a Xiaomi account. This is useful if you want to use Xiaomi Store and stuff like that. I don't care about it, so I'm gonna tap on skip, but you can do it if you want to. And here we can set up a Google Assistant. If you don't care, you can tap on no thanks. And if you want to set it up, tap on set up. More, I agree, more, I agree, then next, and the set assistant should be set up. We can also set the uh, lock screen for our watch, like a pin or pattern. This is useful if you don't want uh, third party uh, people or yeah, people basically accessing your watch without your knowledge. I'm gonna tap on skip, I don't need it, but if you want to set it up, simply tap on one of the options and Follow the instructions. And here we can download additional apps uh, after the installation. I'm just gonna uncheck them. I don't need them, but you can basically check the apps here. And if you tap on continue, it will start installing them automatically. I don't need them, so I'm gonna tap on skip. And here we can uh, enable the notifications. This is useful if you want to receive the notifications from your phone on your watch. If you don't care, you can tap on skip and keep it disabled. If you want to enable them, tap on allow. It will pop up with this uh, window. You need to tap on allow again. Uh, 
And as you can see, we need to log in into a Xiaomi account after all. So I'm gonna tap right here, enter the email address and the password. Okay, check the box that we agree to the terms of use, tap on sign in. And after we log in, the watch should be on the device page. For some reason, it's not here. Let's go back. Uh, tap on OK, tap on device. And it is here now. That was weird. But as you can see, on the device page, we have our uh, watch. And our watch is ready to use. We can use it now. Okay, and that's how you pair this watch with the Android phone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, uh, please leave the like on the video or consider subscribing to our channel.